mentality all. I'm changing out my tumblers and shutting them down for a while, but just pulled out a few pieces of material that I'll show you. Just all in here is this little stuff. A couple agates, a little bit of wood. But right here, this is a nice agate that I got from Jason. This will be going in my collection. Ah, uh, come on, not too bad. A lot of moss in there. Never know it by looking at all the exterior's got stuff going on with it too. But yeah, I've been working on this one for a while. Pretty nice. And that's from Oregon. There's a nice piece of petrified wood I got off the local river here, well on it. And this one will probably go inside in my bucket I got petrified wood, so we'll set him aside. And this is from the local river too. Well on it. I find a lot of petrified wood there, a lot of it. I find so much of it I can be picky in what I pick up. And discard the stuff I don't like. We'll put him there too. Here's some petrified wood from Texas. This is a, just along the Rio Grande River. This was sent to me a long time ago by a buddy down there. Did some horse trading with him. Uh, I got fingerprints all over it, but yeah, that's a nice little piece of petrified wood. Here's some junk. Crazy lace, see the pits in it stuff, but I decided, ah, uh, just roll it. It'll go in the little junk pile that I got started. Probably just give it to a little kid, too. There's another piece of petrified wood. Got a lot of quartz in it. Yeah, I like petrified wood. Okay, that can go in the pile. Here's a piece of Eastern Oregon Jasper. I just rolled it in the rough like that. Turned out pretty nice though. I like that. Got some dark colors to it. A few things going on there. Got a lot of this material, so you're probably going to see a lot of it rolled. Oregon. And this is some stuff from Buddy Scott. And his wife kind of picked up, and they had me roll some, but... I'm not satisfied with how the way I rolled this time around. I'm probably going to do a lot of this stuff over again. I usually get a bit of shine in this. It's kind of like dull. Yeah, it's got a lot of stuff going on with it. Just drag it. This is another piece that Scott gave me. And it did the same thing. It's dull. You know, it even looked better before I put it in. Well, you never know until you try. And then this piece here. This just turned out pretty good here, Scott. Kind of looks like Jasper Agate. Kind of look like the universe of stars out there. Nice little piece. I'm disgusted with this one. Undercut. But it'll still go in the little penny pile. This is from the Blue Mountains, Eastern Oregon. This is Link Gas. I like it. It looks like a turkey in flight, don't it? This going in my private collection. Put him there. Montana agate. This going in my private collection. Love rolling this stuff. Love hounding it. Yellowstone River. Montana. A little bit of Wyoming. There's another Montana. Kind of work this one a little bit. I like it. Got a little cut on there in that degree. Come out pretty nice. This is going in my private collection too. Yeah, 
Yeah, thunder egg. That come out kind of nice. Richardson Ranch, but didn't know it had that little pocket in there, and that pocket come out nice for being tumbled for a month. And some old Big Jasper. This one came out the best. I like this one. There's, there's the call sign of Big Jasper right there. Wasn't much of a piece to work with, so I thought, well, I'll just tumble it. Come out nice and smooth. I think I'll keep that in my private collection too. And I got this material here from the Judith Mountains in Montana. Can't remember how many feet you are up. You're up quite a ways. I know you're over 5,000 feet. There's, there's little minerals in there, Montana black diamonds. So this other rock is the host rock. And boy, I tell you what, it's tough. Up getting them out of there. So I thought, hi, oh, this little piece, I'm just going to roll it and see what happens. Well, that's some tough stuff because it, it stayed tight. But look how square them are. Mother Nature did all that. So it's intricate. I don't know if you're familiar with Montana Black Diamonds. Six sided. Pretty cool pieces. I got some material in the owls, but I'll show you sometime. Just thought I'd roll it once and see what happens, and that's what happens. Kind of a neat material. Put that in my collection too, so ain't much to show you. Just like to share what I've been doing. That's about it for now. I got three more tunnels to clean out later on next week. Appreciate you looking, and as always, thanks for looking.